35 indoors. Back on the women's 800 metres, let's have a look at the lineup for the event. Sharon Stewart of Australia, Paula Fryer of Britain, Charmaine Crooks of Canada, probably be the favourite here. Sue Bevan, Ailing Malloy, Diane Edwards coming back after injury. Jasmine Jones of the USA, Delissa Walton Floyd and Celeste Halliday of the USA, Letitia Vriesdy, who's actually from Suriname rather than Holland, Meredith Rainey of the USA, and uh, Wendy Old of Australia. Well, Charmaine Crooks, I think, is the class runner in this field. She will be wearing number 13 has moved up very successfully from 400 meters to 800 meters and we're looking forward to see how well Diane Edwards the sail harrier runs the 25 year old recovering after a stress fracture only ninth in Belfast but has a personal best of 158.65 but this year has only run times around 204 this is certainly the class of field to test her Running number five there Jasmine Jones at the USA twice an American junior champion now age 21 personal best just outside two minutes the number six Celeste Halliday who was fourth in the American championships and thus just missing the world championships team and she has run under two minutes this year as well stand up please well the starter saying stand up I must say this is a very big field 13 runners in the women's 800 meters we've on the Grand Prix circuit in Europe there's a tendency to put rather too many runners in some of these races this may be one it's one of the reasons, in fact, that it's useful to have pacemakers, because if they do stretch out to a good pace, then, of course, it stretches the fields out. You don't get quite so much bunching. But, Steve, I think you'll agree, rather a lot of women, women in this particular race. Well, it could be quite dangerous um, if there is no pacemaker. At the moment, it doesn't seem to be one that's uh, making a bit for the front. And if they do that, when they actually come in over at the back straight there, there could be a lot of uh, bumping and boring. And uh, it's difficult to see sometimes who causes it or what causes it but you usually find one or two athletes into the floor but luckily as I say that no one's actually in any major problem but look at the look at the pack there you well, really could flow a blanket over there isn't the a pacemaker and they're, and they're pushing each other aren't they Steve and the number some of the numbers to look out for number 12 Delissa Rolton Floyd of the USA wearing number one there Sharon Stewart of Australia the Auckland bronze medalist Charmaine Crooks wears number 13, number 12, Delissa Walter Floyd, though, just tucking in behind Stewart. And on the inside, number three, Sue Bevan. She's losing her place a little bit. Coming up now, number 11, Meredith Rainey, the Harvard graduate, but it's, uh, well, it's a reasonable pace, 59.68. It's a reasonable pace. The most uh, international races are run around about this time. It's not that fast, really, but it's going to bring a time around about uh, two minutes, maybe two minutes one, if they keep this rhythm going. Delissa uh, Walter Floyd there is hitting the front. She's quite an aggressive runner over the last part of... Uh, most 800 meter races but she hasn't really got much speed over the last 200 meters so she's doing the right sort of tactics here by trying to work hard and break the rest of the spirit of the rest of the girls yes to Lisa Walton Floyd who won this race last year a 29 year old married to uh, Stanley Floyd who we saw actually in action winning a B 100 meters earlier today so she wears number 12 then we've got Celeste Halliday wearing number six number 13 Charmaine Crooks and look for Crooks who's got good 400 meter speed she's coming up on the outside I think she's going to be the favorite it's Alyssa Walton Floyd there also between them and the six Celeste Halliday look for 11 Meredith Rainey she's coming on the inside nothing much between them Walter Floyd trying to hang on Crooks is not going to do it and Letitia Vriesdy number seven the Suriname athlete is coming through Vriesdy it is who comes through Walton Floyd in second place well Breezy did it, 2 minutes, 1.83. She's been a consistent runner on the Grand Prix circuit this year. Improved her national record to 159.39 for second in Oslo. A Central American 1500 meter champion based in Holland. And she came through to steal it on the, uh, the finish there. As they're running into a headwind, I think, Steve, there, down the home straight. Well, that's right. I think I was more impressed with your commentating here than some of the running, actually. <laughs> because look at these girls to pick the winner out of this lot. Absolutely amazing. There's 13 runners there, stretched across three or four lanes of the track, and it's anybody's race at this particular point. Number seven there, Vriesley, coming through on the inside, all runners running about the same place. Unfortunately, number 12 there, Walton Floyd, dying slightly for second place, but uh, a very, very tactical race, a lot of pushing and a lot of shoving.